This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. For more information, or to volunteer, visit LibriVox.org. Recorded by Kirsten Ferreri. The practice of the presence of God, the best rule of holy life, being the conversations and letters of Brother Lawrence. Twelfth Letter If we were well accustomed to the exercise of the presence of God, all bodily diseases would be much alleviated thereby. God often permits us that we should suffer a little to purify our souls, and oblige us to continue with Him. Take courage, offer Him your pains incessantly, pray to Him for strength to endure them. Above all, get a habit of entertaining yourself often with God, and forget Him the least you can. Adore Him in your infirmities, offer yourself to Him from time to time, and in the height of your sufferings beseech Him humbly and affectionately, as a child His Father, to make you conformable to His holy will. I shall endeavor to assist you with my poor prayers. God has many ways of drawing us to Himself. He sometimes hides Himself from us. But faith alone, which will not fail us in time of need, ought to be our support, and the foundation of our confidence, which must be all in God. I know not how God will dispose of me. I am always happy, all the world suffer, and I, who deserve the severest discipline, feel joys so continual and so great that I can scarce contain them. I would willingly ask of God a part of your sufferings, but that I know my weakness, which is so great, that if he left me one moment to myself I should be the most wretched man alive. And yet I know not how he can leave me alone, because faith gives me as strong a conviction as sense can do, that he never forsakes us till we have first forsaken him. Let us fear to leave him. Let us always be with him. Let us live and die in his presence. Do you pray for me, as I for you. End of the Twelfth Letter